Hi and welcome back to Joe Talks Cars and welcome to another video. In today's video it's going to be a very very exciting one because today not only am I visiting the motorist hub, my usual haunt it seems throughout the week, but I'm also visiting DMV Collections. So DMB Collections is owned by a guy called Dean. It's based up north, just outside Leeds, and if you watch Archie Hamilton or TG or even Dr. Alex on YouTube, you will have seen Dean a few times. He's been on a few of their videos and he has supplied quite a few of their cars. So what we're going to be doing today is heading out there in the Cayman to see what sort of stock he's got in, have a look round, and yeah, have an awesome day having a look round some amazing supercars. But anyway, I think that's enough waffle for me. I think what we're going to do now is head on out towards the motorist tub, go see Dean, see what he's got for sale, and we'll catch up very, very shortly. here with Dean from DMB Collections and he's going to give us a quick tour around your new garage here. Yeah, How yeah. long have you been trading now? Can't be that long. No, October 19 I set oh, up, yeah. so it wasn't too long ago really yeah. and we've been here about 18 months. Stunning place. So uh, yeah, yeah, it's nice isn't it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's really good. But it's yeah, very, we'll very quiet. And see what you've got. Yeah, show sure, yeah, come on then. I'll, uh... Show me some of your best stuff. <laughs> Even <laughs> starts with these. 1956 yeah. uh, Beetle, yeah. It's so just nice it's, to have. Yeah, it's absolutely. So it's featured in magazines. It was on TV. It did all sorts. It's a nice example, is that? Yeah. So uh, yeah, we did. The reason why I call it collection is because I didn't want it to just be supercars, which is what I was known for before, really. So it's nice to be able to, uh, you know, have a collection of all things automotive, really. So uh, that's why I quite fancy dabbling in a few of these older classics. But yeah, yeah, I mean, it continues really when you come inside here because you're faced with a, a fabulous Escort Cosworth, which is like from my day. It was. Um, Without a doubt, one of some of the best hot hatches you could buy. You know, these were super. So it was, uh, which is nice. Yeah, they're stunning. And they're stunning in great, car. great condition. You know, it's uh, won lots of awards. They're worth a lot of money now. They are, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that one's up at, what, 79995 today. You know, it's, uh, wow. it's crazy, isn't it? Would have been really a good around. investment, that. It will have been for yeah. the first owner, perhaps, yeah. You've just got a lovely so, mix of cars. You've got like that, and then obviously... And then you jump over here. Yeah. and yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah. So it's nice. I mean, we, we spent a bit doing the floors and the walls and everything, you know, we wanted to mm. do that, put the Venetian polished plaster up here with the logo <laughs> and things on there. So it's just simple, yeah. uh, which keeps it nice. But it's lovely having this uh, view outside yes. here, which is great. And so you get to uh, play out there in the cars. Yeah. Dear. It's great. Yeah, yeah. We have a radio to the tower and we uh, go out, we do all our imagery out there, videos wow. and things like that. So you can just take the cars test out and test drive the customers. It's one of the best perks, yeah. Wow. So it's, uh, it's nice. nice. It's a good... But customers love it anyway. Oh, yeah, I can imagine. When you get that experience, really, so it's quite unique, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So it's really nice. But yeah, no, so obviously we're a mix, really, an eclectic mix of yeah. uh, supercars. We do a lot of Audi products as well. The, the very latest M3, of course, which looks mm. stunning. Yeah. Uh, I love the interior of this. Yeah, well, that's got the, the carbon seats. And, that's got the oh. carbon seats, uh, which is important. So, uh, but yeah, it's a lovely spec. Mm. Isle of Man Green, they call it that oh, one. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. I don't know what the colour was, which but is stunning. Nice. Green it's, is like coming in. I think that's going to be the next. The grey, old mate green great again, they say, don't mm. they? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, and it moves on all the way up here, obviously. I do a lot of Porsches because, obviously, that's my background. Mm. So, uh, oh, is that where you came from? Is yeah, it? so I, I worked, uh, oh, yeah, for well over a decade at Porsche. Really? You know, so I worked there oh. for a long time, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but we do limited cars like the Scuderias and yeah. things like that, which is lovely. They're yeah. going up in value quite a lot at the moment. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, that's I recently amazing. drove an F430, it was amazing. Yeah. I drove an SUV Prestige, I sell him one, I had a oh, yeah. driver that. Good out there. Yeah, they, yeah. They, they sound yeah. amazing, don't they? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they sound they good. But so yeah, the 911 um, core, no, you've just got... Well, I do, I usually have... You've uh, literally got every 911 you can <laughs> get. <laughs> we sold quite a few this week, actually, but we do have... I tend to keep this, is always Porsche. So I kind of have this sort of L-shape, if you like, of mm. uh, turbo C4Ss, Targa GTSs. And as you can see, the latest 992s to... 
that you know Turbo S with aero kits, which is fabulous. You know they've got I like all that. them. And this one, I'm really fond of this one. I love yeah. the spec on this, yeah, that not, wing and. Well, that's a unique colour, PTS colour called RAF grey. Oh. So it's uh, it's a very limited edition, is this? Uh, although it wasn't numbered, um, they only produced five of these uh, exclusive editions, um, oh. which is really nice. Mm. So it's, it's a really a lovely nice colour, spec, isn't, it? isn't it? Yeah, and the ducktail. The ducktail, yeah. yeah, yeah, reminiscent of the older. The older Porsches, if mm. you like. This also, with it being a 3.8, has the power kit, which was referred to as an X50 or X51 pack. Ah. So it's got the upgraded kit yeah. on that one, which That'll is about a 10 grand option. Is it really? Mm. So what does that give you? It's about a 50 brake horsepower. Really? Yeah, usually so this around will be that sort of, bit more torque. 400, it'll be. Pardon? Then. Yeah. It'll be 400, yeah. 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 Won't be far off, yeah. Wow. Oh, uh, which is nice. Difference. And then yeah. uh, obviously further back, we've got um, <laughs> obviously a mixture shop. of Ferraris and McLarens and yeah, the F8 Tributo, which is lovely. Yeah, yeah. I've not seen one before. It's the first one I've seen. Yeah, they are really nice. Yeah. I think it's nice for customers to come in and just sort of see, you know, all the brands under one roof, really. Yes. And not just all the brands, but like the best examples of them. Yeah. You know, so, you know, even like the in the corner of the McLarens, you know, we've got a 600 LT with every carbon pack on it. I wondered, it's because it's, yeah, it's covered. We were just yeah. saying it's got, mm. it's just the whole back end is just pure carbon. It must have everything. Yeah, that must lovely. be a well expensive spec. Yeah, it's that. Porsche Cayenne Grey as well, which is yeah. really nice. So that, that's yeah. a, a nice option. That's and the colour Ferrari I would have if I was to choose on that. I'd you? go for blue. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I think everyone wants red and crema, but I'd go blue. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Yeah. And it's, it works well with that tan. It does. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a stunning car. And then we yeah. obviously move on to some of the cars at the back, which is a Speciali in the back there. It's only yeah. done about a thousand miles. Wow. So that's quite rare. Uh, we sold this Portofino now. These are nice. I think these look nice with the roof on. It's quite a successful folding metal yeah. roof. Like often they look a bit bulbous at the back end. But I think this is quite a successful design. They are, they're lovely. Yeah. I mean, in fact, it's only just come in last week in fairness, but we had a, a lady who flew in in a helicopter. Really? Just to stop for fuel and saw the cars and came in and she went, I've always promised myself a Ferrari and uh, bought this. So it's going down to, uh, down south, down to sort of uh, Brighton. But someone flew so, in. Yeah. That's, that's class. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. This yeah. is what, I, I drove one of these, so a Spider F1 gearbox, one of these. Yes. Real weird gearbox. It's like you have to lift off to change gear. Yeah, Otherwise the F1 it's... box. It's a bit, yeah, it's a bit I, I enjoyed it after a while. I found it quite easy. Mm. Um, well, this has only done 4,000 miles. Has it really? Yeah. 4,000 miles. Yeah, it's just the same so, as the one I drove. Yeah, yeah. it's an it's F1 box as well. Yeah. No, they are nice. It felt... Like, for me, this is like a new car still. It yeah. made me feel really old when they told me it was 16. I was like, oh, oh no, right, yeah. Oh. I know. oh, no. I remember it coming out, and I still consider this a modern Ferrari. Yeah. But it's yeah. not now. They change very quickly, don't they, when you think yeah. about what this is now. So, yeah, yeah. You know, they really do vastly change, don't they? Mm. So, uh, yeah, and then obviously we've got a lovely Mercedes AMG GTR, which sounds like a yeah. beast. Yeah, I bet it does. <laughs> So what, Four litre. So the GTR, the difference being this one is more track focused, isn't it? It is, yeah, exactly that, yeah. yeah. So it's got more aero on it. So that's, uh, yeah, more track focused car. Obviously a lot stiffer suspension, carbon roof, things like that, so it's yeah. nice. But a good looking car. Oh, it is, yeah. You know. Has it got the exhaust in the middle? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but actually, if you look further down, the exhaust mm -hmm. at the side. Oh, right, yeah, more Underneath, of them. hidden. So, oh, uh, no, that's lovely, that. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Probably one of the favourite things in here is this one, though. Yeah. The LT, that yeah. is crazy. The seats in that. I mean, oh, they, they can't be comfortable. <laughs> they are, they are. When you're actually in them, they are. Yeah. It's just the getting in and out, getting possibly. Getting in and out, yeah. But when you're in there, if in all fairness, probably out of a lot of cars here, maybe the McLaren excluded, but it feels pretty much like the best supercar you drive. Really? It's just a great feel with them, yeah. Very sharp, very light, very fast. It ticks all the boxes. Yeah. You know, it really is quite exhilarating to drive of these because they're phenomenally quick and the way these things go around corners is just unbelievable. You know, usually it says slow down for a bend, doesn't it, on road? Yeah, but you yeah. speed up in these. Wow. <laughs> you just do Because the, the 720s, they're meant to be really comfortable, aren't they? Yeah, they they're, are, yeah. They're like a good cruiser. Yeah. They were a good car. That was the first time I went to uh, Monaco with the... Uh, YouTube guys there. Really? Oh, and you took and I that? took the black one, we had a black oh, one we had, yeah. and it was, uh, that was really good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was superb. <laughs> so, wow. no, it's, uh, so just not, not a bad few. No, you've got a lovely selection of cars. <laughs> really nice. Yeah, it's all right, isn't it? Yeah. I appreciate you coming. Yeah, thank you for uh, showing me around. No, no, you're very welcome. And obviously, we've got a few other cars 
outside on the forecourt, yeah. you know, some four by fours, G wagons, SVRs, that type of thing. Yeah. KN Turbo S's, which is yeah, nice. I love the hybrid KN yeah, Turbo it's lovely, S. Isn't it? That's yeah. what I want to have a go yeah, in. Yeah, it's really nice. I borrowed a 911 and I said to my wife, this is a family car and it yeah. turned out, no, it's not. You can't get a kid in the back yeah. of it. Horrendously small. She was like, bring me a KN back <laughs> and we might have a conversation. Yeah, <laughs> yeah well, they are lovely. And then have mm. another unit. We've got some other cars like uh, 66 Mustangs and American oh, yeah. trucks oh, and wow. stuff like that in there. Yeah. So that's quite nice. So yeah. They're all just listed on your website. and this Pretty is your, much. We've yeah. About, yeah, we have stock about just short of 70 cars, really. Yeah. Wow. So there's quite a few, but we like to keep some of the supercars inside here mm. and spaced out so people can have a look and walk around mm. really. So yeah. yeah, so no, it's all right. No, it's a lovely place. Thank you for yeah. showing me around. You're very welcome. Nice to meet you. You too. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Cheers. Cheers. Right, so I think we're going to end the video there, but thank you very much for watching and thank you for Dean for showing us around this amazing collection he's got up here. So links to all the socials and the website for the DMB collection will be in the pinned comment and in the description. So make sure you go and check him out. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.